when a band is on tour or an artist, um, usually instrumentalists, and that's where I'll speak from, are on with uh, on tour supporting a celebrity or a leader, uh, or they're part of a, an ensemble where everybody's kind of an equal partner. Uh, the, the, the rigors of being on the road uh, necessitate having people wear different hats and having different people that maybe are not even in the band uh, play a role. For example, I'll just give you several examples. Uh, when I was on the road with Liberace, there was a wardrobe guy, there was a stage manager, there was a, an agent, uh, and there was uh, uh, the, uh, I forget the title that he carried, but he was the one that made certain that ground transportation was at the airport, that uh, we had a way to get to the venue, that everybody in the, in the band had their gear in their suitcases, and they would all show up and they knew what time the rehearsal was and the sound check and that everybody knew uh, where the food was gonna be obtained and you knew which time showtime was and is this a coat and tie gig or is this a denim gig or is this a tuxedo gig? And uh, anyway, the different acts that I've traveled with, uh, the Osmonds and Chris Ledoux and Enoch Train and James Moody and Lex De Azevedo and um, and Liberace, those are, the, those are the groups that I've been on the road with. Primarily, um, depending on the size of the budget, that's what uh, uh, dictated whether there was a large supporting cast or not. So with Chris Ledoux, we all rode in a van, we all stayed at Motel 6, and we all ate at Denny's, and we were the ones that set up and broke down the PA, and we were the ones that stood in line signing merchandise for all the fans. <laughs> And so it was a long, grueling day. Uh, with Liberace and the Osmonds, it was kind of the other way around. Um, fans weren't interested in who was in the band. Uh, they only wanted the celebrity's signature, the autograph. And, uh, uh, but there were more uh, players that made the load lighter. You know? And so a person that uh, took care of reservations, uh, uh, took care of you know, feeding the band uh, made it so that all we had to think about was just music. And uh, so anyway, some of the people that can be on the road with a band, merchandising, who's going to sell t-shirts and CDs and uh, baseball caps, uh, autograph photos, whatever, you know. And uh, if somebody needs to be in charge of that. Maybe somebody uh, is on the road that does strictly lights or um, maybe there's somebody that uh, uh, is completely involved with uh, uh, the back line, you know, getting gear to the gig, uh, especially if the gig's in Pittsburgh one night and Chicago the next. Um, sometimes the gear has to be rented from a local backline company rather than flown or trucked, uh, especially if it's even farther than that. Miami one night and Las Vegas the next, you know, so. Uh, those are some of the uh, characters or, that play supporting roles on, on tour.